So today I'm going to show you how to make one of my favorite breakfast muffins. They are a whole wheat zucchini bran muffin. Even though they're 100% whole wheat, they are so moist and actually really easy to make. Now, if you're new to whole wheat baking, don't worry. I'm going to give you all the tips that you're going to need to make the perfect muffins the first time and every time. All right, so for these muffins, what we're going to do is we start by grating the zucchini. I always do this for your first because it's going to release a lot of moisture as it sits there. So grate this down all the way, set it aside, and then we're going to mix together our dry ingredients. Now I used wheat bran, you can see here, but you can also use oat bran if you want kind of a milder flavor. One thing to note too is that you want to have the oven preheating while you're mixing this. You want it to be hot, hot, 400 degrees when we get the muffins in, so it's best to start that early. Now next up we're going to add in our granulated sugar, brown sugar, melted butter, and canola oil. The key to getting really moist whole wheat baked goods is that you've got to add moisture back in somehow. Now we do this through ingredients and we also do this through method. Oil will um, make the muffins a lot more moist. Butter of course is for the flavor. Now another ingredient that helps with moisture as well is this um, plain Greek yogurt. You can also use sour cream if you prefer, but that adds back in a lot of moisture also. Now again, a key that you want to note here is you don't want to over mix it once you add in the eggs. You just want to mix it until it's combined. So at this point, we're just kind of careful about how much we mix it. Mix it all together. You can also see I have some little clumps of brown sugar in there. I probably should have, I don't know, gotten a new bag or something. Anyway, once the eggs and those ingredients are in, we're going to add in our dry ingredients. You're going to mix this again only to combine. You can see that I mix a few times through the center. Then I'm always making sure to scrape the edge, edges. That way we don't have any dry um, ingredients that kind of get into the batter afterwards. Then once this is all mixed together, we're going to take our zucchini. Again, very importantly, make sure you squeeze out that moisture. Ugh, I've forgotten that before and thrown it in and it just makes kind of a mess in the, in the muffins. We want moisture, but we don't want that kind of moisture back into the muffins. So we're going to mix this again and then once this is all mixed together we're going to scoop it into our muffin pans and then we're going to bake this first for seven minutes at 400 degrees. This will give it a nice little pop, a nice little oven spring for a whole wheat baked goods of course. We don't get oven spring like, like when you use refined flours. But it's 400 degrees for seven minutes then we reduce that heat to 350 and finish baking it off. Now here's what they look like when they're done. You can see, I mean, the flavor is just so amazing. If you could smell this, you would want one or two or 10. I don't even know. Now, of course, as always, all the ingredients measurements are going to be in the description and don't forget to subscribe. You are not going to want to miss any of the new videos that are coming out soon.